Hello everyone, I'm so happy to welcome you back to my channel. In this video I want to show you how to make this beautiful snowflake and I think it's perfect for Christmas winter decoration and if you want to learn how you can make it as well, keep on watching! So first we are going to start with the materials. We are going to need cloth pins. Here I'm using two different sizes but feel free to use only one if you want. We are going to need white glue as well. Also acrylic paint and brush, glue gun and glue sticks and stuff for decorations like uh, rhinestones and glitter, of course this is optional. So let's get started. The first thing that we have to do is to take away the metal mechanism that it's holding the pin. So we have to take it away and we're gonna be left with two uh, wood uh, parts. And I forgot to mention that for the bottom part of the snowflake, the bigger part, we are going to need 8 pins in total. So here we have all our wooden parts separated. So we have to take our white glue and put a little bit on the smooth side of the pin. And then we are just going to take the other side and attach it to the other. And you're going to have a shape like this. And it will be good if we left them to dry for at least one minute. And then when we have all the pieces uh, ready, we're gonna take one of them and take our glue gun and put a little bit of a glue in on the bottom part. And then we're going to take the other pin and attach it. And you can see that I'm attaching two angles together. And it basically it's super easy because the pins already have this angle so you, it's really easy to attach it and then we have to do the same until we have something like a cross. So when we have the base part ready, we are just going to keep on adding the other pieces. And as you can see, I'm putting one piece between uh, the previous two. And we just have to repeat the same step until we attach all the pieces that we have left. And now we have the base part of the snowflake ready. You can totally leave it like that. It's still very pretty, but I decided to make uh, the same one, but from the smaller pins because I want to attach the smaller one on the top of the bigger one and make it even uh, prettier. But it's definitely your choice. Um, you can definitely leave it like that and decorate it. So here I'm putting a little bit of a glue and then I'm attaching the smaller one uh, on the top of the bigger one. So now we have the shape of the snowflake ready. You can leave it like that. It's uh, still very very pretty I think in my opinion. I decided to paint it in white and I'm using acrylic paint but you can use spray paint or any other paint that you want. I think acrylic paint it's the best because while it's uh, drying I'm just going to take a little bit of glitter and then I'm going to take the glitter and sprinkle it on the top of um, the snowflake before the paint dries because in this way while the paint is drying the glitter will stay put on the snowflakes and in the end you don't have to top it off with anything else. And when you're finished with the glitter don't forget to let it dry for a while. And for a perfect finish I'm just going to add in the center of the snowflake one rhinestone. I think that this snowflakes is perfect for a winter theme decoration. Uh, you can put it whatever you want around the house. You can put it on a Christmas tree or uh, for whatever you want to use it. I think the result is absolutely gorgeous. It's really beautiful and sparkly in my opinion. And in the end I just wanted to show you a second option. I made a small snowflake from the small uh, cloth pins and I just decorated it with uh, rhinestones. I wanted to show you the second option because uh, as you can see you can decorate the snowflakes in so many different ways, in so many different colors depending on your imagination. 
I really hope you liked this video. Please let me know in the comments below what do you think about it. And thank you so much for watching. As always, I wish you all the best and happy holidays and see you soon with my next video. Bye!